But first this evening, a suspect under arrest after a violent attack on an MTA conductor in the Bronx. It is video you will see only on Eyewitness News. Good evening, everyone. I'm Sandra Bookman. And I'm Joe Torres. Police say the conductor was stabbed after an altercation on the platform of the 149th Street and the Grand Concourse Station. Eyewitness News reporter Kimberly Richardson tweeted out exclusive photos. She has the story from the South Bronx. I'm still shook. I'm still shook right now. That's because Tina was right there just a few feet away from Walter Rivera, seen here in this exclusive video. <laughs> when she tells me the 20-year-old pulled out this knife and started stabbing her co-worker. Oh, he took off his shirt, blood is just oozing out of his back. Oozing. He's sitting, he didn't even know. I guess the drilling was so there. He didn't even feel it. This is exclusive video of the victim right after the attack. He's a platform conductor who works here at the subway station at 149th and the Grand Concourse in the Bronx. Just before 11 this morning, witnesses say Rivera simply walked up to the victim who was sitting on this bench and lashed out. And then they see, you know, the guy comes from nowhere and smacks him in his face. So he jumps up, he turns to him. It's like, yo, what's going on? What's going on? They start tussling. So as he started, the guy is stabbing him in his back, and he doesn't have no idea about this. So he got him subdued. He held his hands down while the cops run over, and they got him now. That MTA worker was taken here to Lincoln Hospital and is expected to be okay. Witnesses tell me right before this incident, Rivera was on a landing above that platform harassing women. He was looking for trouble. Why would you have a knife? if you're not looking for trouble. Police did recover the knife and charge Rivera with assault and criminal possession of a weapon. All of this worries Tina and others who say the victim is a good guy who helps everyone. It's scary now. We as MTA workers, it's getting more dangerous for us. In the Bronx, Kimberly Richardson, Channel 7, Eyewitness News.